Sandy Class. Welcome back to our next update. Hope everything is good with you all and uh, you're keeping safe and well. So, what have I got to show you this week? I have got lots here. The Sunday Class have been really, really busy at home. Well done, everybody. Uh, first of all, I've got some science homework to show you from Matthew and Darwin. They've done their research and their scientists and they've sent that in to me. So that should be up here. And then well done to those two people. Uh, keep going with those science projects, those everybody else. If you're working on the week's work learning and you've got extra time, you can put a little bit of time towards researching one of the scientists for that as well. And then last week we asked you to look at some Greek jugs and design your own. So I have got Darwin's here to show you. And I've also got Grace's to show you. Now Grace has been extremely lucky and they had some clay at home. So she actually made her jug out of clay. Really, really great job. Really lovely. Poppy and Kyra have both been working on their math skills at home. Well done to those people, people. Kyra has even been teaching her mummy how to do it. So that's all good news too, because if you can teach somebody else, you know it yourself. And then lots of you have been sending me things in about a variety of things you've been doing, which uh, shows the chance to actually look at other things while you're at home. Megan has been helping to train her seven month old puppy. I should think that's probably jolly good work, hard work at the moment to be doing that. So you keep going with that, Megan. Brooke has been looking for angles in her garden. So she sent a few pictures in of those angles shown on it. That was a really great idea. I might steal that when we're back at work, back at school, and do that in our lesson times too. James has been busy. He's been looking at his handwriting. Great time to practice that. Uh, he's been teaching his brother some maths. Um, again, brilliant. And he and Henry separately have been running uh, several kilometers and raising money for the NHS. Great work, boys, well done, you two. Henry then has got a banner he's brought, sent in to me that he's made with his sister Penny. Looks fantastic, you two, lovely. Tobias, Tobias has been working on uh, long walks with his family, but at the same time, he's been learning how to use an OS, Ordnance Survey Map. So that's really good to hear that too. Great geography skills. And he's also been having a go at becoming Tobias Wicks, which I had a jolly laugh at when I was listening, reading that in my emails. So this is a clip of Tobias being Tobi uh, Tobias Wicks. Well, guess I'm here. There you are. A Tobias coach. Four dollars. First, I'll bet starts with this. It's back in the twilight. Now, when in the spot, just get your warm up boy out. Now, next. And we're looking forward to looking at these game stories next week. I've had a copy of Tobias's game that he sent to me that includes a portal. Great use of the, our literacy we had, the English work we had before we uh, stayed at home. And then I've had Alice send me part of her story set in a horse's stables. Great use of vocabulary because all the things, technical vocabulary to do with horses that she knows it was all in her story. Darwin sent me his story all about the cursed locket. I was really quite frightened at what was going to happen to those uh, the story the characters in the story uh, for that. So we we'll look forward to seeing how, the, how that story develops. Megan has sent me her story too, and I'm really looking forward to seeing how they develop into next week. 
So next week we've got our new video up ready to you to have a look at. Uh, I will be there. And it has got all about the game still, some more Greek things. If you want extra things, if you want things to do whilst you're having a bit of downtime, you think, actually, I want to learn something different. Uh, BBC Bite Size are doing activities and learning videos on there. Uh, one of my children this week had a look at Spanish. They've not done any Spanish before. They decided they'd learn, or try to learn, the Spanish numbers 1 to 10. Something different to have a go at. Why not? Time table rock stars, Sunday. Hmm. The learning video you'll watch today talks about how Sunday are in the lead. I have a horrible feeling we may have lost that lead. I think we might find that, that the other classes have taken over, or at least Barlow have taken over. So, Sunday, get back on that time table rock stars and get those points back up to where they're meant to be because we always are in the lead of that. We can't lose it now. Not come May of the year. We've been in the lead all the way through the year. Keep on that, get those points back up. Reese, Brooke, and the rest of you, we need those points. Keep the I'm doing time to rock stars. So the games, we look forward to having those stories finished next week, and you can send them to, to me and I can read them through. I'm happy to give you a mark if you, if you wish that, uh, to see what you would have achieved within school if you had been at school. I've been giving a couple of OAs out already over these videos or over the emails over the last couple of weeks. So look forward to that as well. You can add to that as well our OA list of uh, um, collecting those ready for the end of the year. Okay, what about me? What have I been doing this week? Well, this week we've been really busy learning and I've been busy with the work for school. So we haven't done as much this week. We have uh, been on a few walks up to Knoll Park, some beautiful scenery up there at the moment. Um, so we've been doing that. Uh, we've made some chocolate chip scones because that was the request, so that's what we did. And we have been looking at doing a, a, some, pa a some painting, and we had to go up for painting a banner as well. So that's us at home this week. And mo most, most of it is all about our learning, um, and then having some downtime as well, having time on the trampoline, getting out and about, and activities as well, like those sort of things. So that's our week here uh, at my house and your houses with all of the work you've given in to me thank you for those emails i really do appreciate those emails coming in i look forward to looking at them in the morning open it all up see how many i've received and then through the day i check it in every so often oh have i got any more have i got any more emails so uh that was it really nice to see and i, th I think i had a few less this week but i think that's because you're keeping those stories ready for next week so i'm looking forward to that and seeing lots more stories of those so keep working hard, keep going with their skills. It's all for our, us ready for year six. Keep working, keep safe, keep being kind to all in your, in your household and we will keep going. Thank you, Sandy. We'll see you next time. <laughs>